Uncertainty about the future is at the centre of risk. If we always knew exactly what was going to happen, there wouldn't be any risk. Because we don't, we can't be certain of anything. Risk is assessed by insurers in terms of frequency, how often something might happen, and severity, how costly it would be if it did happen. Imagine a house by a river that is known to flood. No one knows if the river will overflow again. But because the river is prone to flooding, the risk to the house is increased. Now imagine a second house, 100 metres up a hill from the river. This house is less likely to be at risk from flooding because of its position. But what about severity? Imagine that the house further from the river is much larger. It should be insured for a far greater amount because of the potential severity of loss, damage or destruction. Frequency and severity will both be part of an insurer's risk assessment, but the relationship between them varies. An example of high frequency and low severity of loss could be motor insurance, which usually entails a large number of small claims for things like dented bumpers and cracked windscreens. Low frequency and high severity of loss means a small number of events resulting in very high costs, such as aircraft accidents and oil spillages. So there we have it, frequency and severity.